All right, well, the holidays, they are over, and we are back to our first full week of January, back to school, back to work. And we are feeling definitely very seasonable out there with those cold temperatures. Wind chill, add in that wind factor, feels about 28 degrees in Galax, 29 Reedsville, Greensboro, Asheboro at 26, and 25 in Burlington. So definitely a cold start for this morning. Grab the warm extra layers as you head out the door. For this afternoon, really only a light jacket needed. A lot like yesterday where we had the beautiful blue skies, Sunshine all the way around. Winds will calm down. Just a few of those gusts upwards, about 15 for the mountains. Otherwise, temperatures upper 40s. Then we work our way low to mid 50s for the rest of us. Now for tomorrow, here's where we do have some of those changes and where we could see a little bit of some wintry mix. It's not the best probability and not the best shot because temperatures they are warm, staying above freezing. The ground is warm as well. The system that's working its way here, it's going to really race on through here. And with that cold front, it's a very thin line of rain. So very light accumulations, talking only a couple tenths of an inch as far as rain. For the mountains, that's where we could see about an inch, even upwards about three, mainly the further north you go and to the higher elevation. So that is where we do have that winter weather advisory in place. That starts tomorrow morning at 4 a.m. and does go through your Tuesday afternoon to 4 p.m. So even then, it's not going to be a prolonged event and mainly just watching out for any of those slippery spots on some of the roadways. For tomorrow, headed out into the morning hours, morning commute, kids head to the bus stop, really not looking like too many issues. It's mainly just the cold temperatures again, then those cloudy skies. This has even been backing off as the morning has gone on. Earlier, looking to arrive around 8 o'clock, now about 9 to 10, you can see out towards the west, the pink, some white, that's that winter, wintry mix, the sleet, some of the snow, and really this little bubble just kind of stays out here towards the north and the west, and then pushes even further off towards the north. So yes, the triad foothills may see a few little flakes mixed in with the rain. It's not going to be a snow event by any means, mainly just off towards the west where it could see a little accumulation. But here's that thin line along with the cold front, really that narrow bound band of rain as that does continue to push on through here. Lunchtime, early afternoon, two to three, picking the kids up from school. Also not having too much activity left back behind. By your Tuesday night, driving home from work or head out for dinner, clear skies and also those dry conditions. So it does not really linger too much back behind either. Dry overnight Tuesday, and then we continue with the dry and sunny skies. Wednesday, Thursday, temperatures back towards the low 50s, warmer low 60s as we get into Friday with a much better rain chance into the weekend. Carly,